This is a short overview of how to use Seesaw for art class. First thing you're going to do is enter your Seesaw account. Up in the corner, press on your name. That'll open up all your other subjects. Once you choose your art class, go to activities. Activities is that light bulb. This will bring you to your new activities. Click on the picture of the activity where you see the link symbol. In our class, this will most often bring you to a slideshow. Down below here is where you will advance your slides. On a slide that you see a play symbol, that means there's a video for you to watch. Please watch this. This is where you will find the instructions for your assignment. I also like to have a slide with a timer. You can set the timer and a project sample. That means the example that the teacher did. Once you've created your art, you're going to go back to the activity and add response. Most students like to use the draw option, but there's other ways of adding your response. My favorite is the draw option. Try very hard to get a nice, beautiful picture of the art that you've created. You can do that by choosing photo over here on the side. Once you have the art the way that you want it, hit the green check mark up in the corner. If you're not sure in your activities what you have completed and what you haven't, click on the light bulb, activities. The first thing is a plus. That's things that you need to do. Then there's a green check mark. That is things that you have completed. The last thing I wanna show you is the inbox. So where it says inbox, you will see different messages that myself or other teachers have presented to you. Sometimes it's information about Google Meets. Sometimes it's information of how to do your project. 